Good day, good sirs and my ladies. In this video I will show the first footage of the first skill I call Dark Bolt. Indeed not the best name ever, but just as with anything in this video, it can and probably will be changed. But enough rambling, time to get to some very basic gameplay. First up is the intro text, already giving the player a small sense of the world you as a player have found yourself into. Here you see the character sprite without any armor or weapons, standing on a rather random tile. This tile has nothing to do with the skill and is just to make movement more viewable as shown here by moving in all four directions. Using the W, the A, the S, the D button, and back on the platform. Now onto the skill itself. Here you see the summoning circle being created under the player. After which beams of shadow or beams of darkness will rise up above the player that are supposed to create and power up the eventual projectile that will be launched in the direction the player is facing. This will most likely be changed so that the projectile is launched towards where the mouse is pointing to give the player more freedom in the direction he or she wants to fire its projectiles. Also, the creation and disappearance of the summoning circle itself will be changed so that it fades in and fades out instead of just popping in and out, due to the popping in and out looking a bit on the cheap side, I must say. The colors will also get a slight rework, especially the beams due to them being rather light pink and that not really fitting in with the general dark palette I want to have with this game. The Dark Bolt itself, the projectile that flies upwards after the beams and the circle it disappeared, uh, will be changed due to it just being a placeholder sprite, since I did not have the proper time to create a fully animated and good looking projectile, especially a shadowy projectile. For people unfamiliar with the name placeholder, it basically means that it's just a rushed sprite that will not be in the final product and is just meant to make the skill more clear as to what it does. Or in this case, creating a projectile from the beams that will be launched in a direction. This was the presentation. Um, if you have any questions and or suggestions, do please mention them in the comments or send an email to thesimmon at gmail.com. Next week, I will be showing off the first mob in the game and this skill impacting that mob, hopefully killing it if I have done my job. And yes, hope you all enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys next time. Okay, that was a little bit ripped off from Husky, but it does sound great. Good day to you all. Farewell.